Okay, so hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Nino Kuni Wrath of the White Witch. Now, I'm sorry I, I didn't speak in the first few seconds of this, I was actually, um, I was actually, <laughs> got to unmute my mic. So don't, don't worry, it is not off sync. It is not off sync. What could be hidden in a place like this? A mighty spell book! Huh? A book? But it will burn in there. Not this book. The wizard's companion laughs in the face of fire. Wouldn't be much of a spell book if it didn't, now, would it? Really? Aha! Gotcha! <coughs> this is a spell book? That there is the wizard's companion, the fount of all wizarding knowledge. The wizard's companion. Okay, I have Tim the wizard's companion as well. Okay, yeah, this is basically, again, just telling you what you're doing. Um, I don't really want to have to read this for you because you'll get bored. Now, I did try before in my life playing before to type in Alex Killings and it didn't work because it's not in a space. I'm just going to type in my name, Alex. Yeah, I mean, that's fine. I mean, you don't see it again, so, yeah. <laughs> you know, I obviously am called Alex. I'm not like Bob or anything. <laughs> now, so we call myself Tidy. Bob Killings. Right, magic in our way over to my world, is it? Hmm, now let's see. What is it? You got a wand somewhere by here? We can't go casting spells without a wand now, can we? A wand? Why would we have a wand? Oh, that's a pain. Ah, well, can't be helped. We'll just have to look for one outside. Huh? We won't find one out there either. Don't nitpick, crybaby bunting. Bunting? My name is Oliver. Oliver. Ah, so the crybaby bit was right, at least, was it? Ah. Uh. Righto, time to find ourselves a magic wand. You mean, there's one hidden somewhere around here? Like, the spell book? Ha! You're having a laugh if you think I'm going to make it that easy, man. What do you think I am? Made of wizarding equipment? No, this one's going to be a little more difficult. But our journey over to my world is a hunt for the soul snare, among other things. So, why don't you treat this as a warmer? The Easter egg hunt, before the wild goose chase, if you will. The... huh. Um, okay, I guess. Okay, I'm lying. The thing is, I never brought a wand with me. I mean, look at me. The price of this level of this livability is my small stature. Enter. I only just I only just managed to carry that flipping book, man. Any more, and I'd have been crushed. So even fairies tell lies, huh? Of course they do. Us fairies are incorrigible. <laughs> I've never actually seen this word before, guys. Incorrigible. <laughs> what the hell is that? Incorrigible. Okay, I've actually never heard that word before, guys. Liars. Anyway, no point crying over spilled milk. Let's find ourselves a substitute, shall we? A substitute? How can there be a substitute for a magic wand? Well, if you can find something brown and sticky, like maybe a stick, we might just be able to muddle through. Uh, okay. So, you're sure a stick will work? Do you think I'm sending you up the guardian path or something? Fine, I'll give you a hand. Follow me, Bunting. Yeah, I'm sorry about the last part, though, being, um, you know, no commentary. I, 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 for some reason, didn't save. Anyway, let's talk to Drippy again. Hey, what are you looking at? Don't tell me you're thinking of using that, this lamppost of a thing wand. Well, you can cut that out for a start. It's way too flipping big. We need a stick or something like that. Enter. Why don't we go and have a look over by there? Uh, okay. Come on, Ollie boy. Yeah, I, so I have changed the audio, so it should be all right now. So, I hope it is. This one's proper tiny motor, eh? Might get yourself one of these. Ahem. Sorry, not, now's not really the time, is it? There ain't anything one like over by here, either. Let's go look over the other side, shall we? Uh, okay. Oh, and when you find something, don't forget to pop it in your bag for safekeeping. Yeah, okay, again. Just telling you about your bag, really. Put it in my bag. Sure. Bomber's bag is basically something good as well, because, like, you know in some games like the Elder Scrolls, you're kind of like, okay, what the hell? You know, I'm carrying, <laughs> I'm carrying seven pieces of armor, um, nine swords, an axe, and a great, great sword, my clothes, loads of food, and you know, loads of dragon bones. How am I carrying all this? So it's, it's good they invented something that makes it believable as well. <sighs> it's no use. There's nothing around here that looks like a wand. You're not wrong, Bunting. All right, we better split up then. Broaden the search light. I'll go and take another look over around your house, and you stay by here and head up the outside search, okay? Uh, uh okay. 
Okay, brown and sticky. Brown and sticky. Oliver? Huh? Oh, it's you. You're, you're the little girl I met before, huh? Mm-hmm. We met before. So, how do you know who I am? I'm really, really sorry, Oliver. Huh? Your mummy. I'm sorry. I couldn't save her. Huh? I don't... Why would you be sorry for that? I wanted to save her. I really did. Huh? Hey, wait. Where are you... going? Hey, where did you go? Ollie boy, why are you talking to thin air? Mr. Drippy, she disappeared again. Huh? Who did? That strange girl. That's the second time she tried to talk to me. What's that? A girl? Where? You're right about strange. I can't see her any flipping where. Well, how could you? She disappeared into thin air. Well, anyway, there's something I want to ask you. There is? Uh, sure. Go ahead. Do you mind it? You know, having a sidekick, like. Huh? A sidekick? Who do you mean? Crikey, that's cold. Who do you mean, he says? Why not stab me in the heart while you're at it? I mean me! I wanted to know if it was all right me joining you on your adventures. Or if you were maybe wanting to trade me in for a younger, prettier model. But it looks like I got my answer, huh? Well, so you know, if you don't have faith in people, you'll never see their true worth. And what's more? Look at this. Huh? It was on the ground, right where that girl was standing. Chuck it here, then. Ta. Well, I'll be a monkey's uncle. It's a wand. You mean it? A real wand? Come over by here and take a look, man. It might seem like any old stick, but it's got all magic right in on it, see? It does, huh? Wow. Is that how people ride in your world? The rooms are all faded, so it might have lost a bit of power. But, for our current purposes, it's a beauty. Neato! What a stroke of luck. Luckier than you know, Ollie boy. Phew, I never thought we'd actually find one. Do you think maybe that girl brought it here for me? So I obtained an old stick, which is basically just the wand. Right. Now we need a place to cast our spell. To cast Gateway, you need somewhere proper massive. You need space to give it oomph, see? Do we really need that much oomph? Yeah, what kind of question is that? Magic is special, isn't it? You have to cast spells in the best environment possible. You really are new to this, aren't you? This is beginner stuff we're talking about here. Oh, uh, sorry. Now, take me somewhere with plenty of space. It's got to be somewhere around by you. Um, the town square, I guess. Yeah, I've stopped, I've stopped playing this game as well because finally the Skyrim DLC's come out. Finally, you know, I mean, I'm really glad to see the DLC finally here. Um, so I have taken a break from this and I haven't quite finished actually. Um, but you know, we're going to pause the part here and in the next part we will make our journey to the other world. So I'll see you then guys. Stay cool and stay sexy.